Hey, Blockchain Visionaries, it's George Levy. I pulled over right now because it was raining and I wanted to record a quick video to get this out of my chest. I want to answer one of the questions that I get most often from students and that is, when do I get into the cryptocurrency market? That's one of the most pressing questions that I get from many, many of my students. They look at me and they say, well, George, you got into Bitcoin, you got into the cryptocurrency market. How can I get into the cryptocurrency market? When's the best time to get in? So. I'm not going to give you financial advice. I'm just going to share with you what I've done, how it's worked for me, but I want you to think it through because it will make a lot of sense for you. And the key question that I want to tell you is from everything that I've seen in my experience, timing the cryptocurrency market to figure out when to get in or when to get out is a sure recipe for disaster because you'll never know where the price is going to go. And if you get in and you think it's going to go up and then it tanks, then you're screwed. So the answer is, don't try to time it. What I want you to know is that getting into the cryptocurrency market is something you should have already done. But if you haven't, do it now. And I'll tell you exactly how you can do it. The way that you do it is you don't have to buy a full coin. That is, don't risk your entire life savings to buy one Bitcoin. For $40,000, don't buy a fraction of a Bitcoin. You can do that. You can buy just $100. So if you want to get into the cryptocurrency market, instead of putting your kid's college education or your car payment or your mortgage, just because you're trying to scrounge up enough to buy one Bitcoin, don't do that. Just buy a fraction of a Bitcoin and in the process, you'll already be in the cryptocurrency market. I tell you, let me give you a perfect example. My father, my father's in his 90s. I got my dad into the cryptocurrency market back in 2017. At the time when I got to, I had a conversation with my dad. I said, dad, you should buy some Bitcoins. At the time, the price of Bitcoin was roughly or close to a thousand bucks. Let's just round it to a thousand dollars. We're talking end of 2017, early 2018, but we're looking, let's say it's a thousand dollars for the price. My dad freaked out. My dad's like, I can't put a thousand bucks into Bitcoin. This is my retirement money. I don't have that kind of money to risk and lose it. I said, Dad, you don't have to risk a thousand bucks. Just put in a hundred bucks. My dad put in a hundred bucks. And we thought it through. Here's the thing. If the price would have tanked out and Bitcoin failed, he lost a hundred bucks. But today, that, that hundred dollars is worth around four thousand dollars. Why? Because the price of a one Bitcoin back then was a thousand dollars. But the price of that same Bitcoin now is $40,000 and his $100 is now worth $4,000. Not a bad return for a hundred buck gamble. And that's what I'm trying to tell you. At this moment, you could do the same. You could buy $100 worth of Bitcoin at the price that we got now, or I don't even know where we are at the price because you may be watching this video at a totally different time. But as of this time, it's $40,000. You put in a hundred bucks and if the price goes up, your hundred bucks becomes more. If the price goes down, your hundred dollars becomes less. But hold on, because I got to tell you the volatility in the market doesn't mean that it's always going to go down. Sometimes it goes back up and many people are actually estimating that the price of one Bitcoin will reach a hundred thousand, three hundred thousand, maybe a million dollars. But guess what? If you don't have any Bitcoin, you're not going to be able to participate in the game. So my advice to you is, and I'm telling you again, it's not financial advice. It's just what I've done and what I recommend you may look at is don't buy a full Bitcoin or any coin. You want to buy some Ether? Just buy $100 worth of Ether. You want to buy some uh, Bitcoin? Just buy $100 worth of Bitcoin. When you do that, you will be able to get a wallet. You'll be able to buy some Bitcoin. You'll know how to use Bitcoin. You'll be able to track the price and know the volatility. When it goes up, you know, when the price goes down, it's almost like you're watching a game, but if you're watching the game as a spectator, as opposed to gambling in the game, like putting some money down of who's gonna win. I'm not telling you to gamble either. All I'm trying to tell you is this, it's a lot more fun when you look at the market and all of a sudden your investment rose. And I tell you, there's a lot of rides that you can take. And what I will tell you, many of my good friends that actually got into the Bitcoin market when the price of Bitcoin was around 2000, it was around 17,000, close to $18,000 last time that it went up. And then we had a drop and we had a big bear market. Those people were really frustrated, but the ones that held on to their investment today are geniuses because they more than doubled their money. And the thing is when you're dealing with cryptocurrencies and you're dealing with Bitcoin, the end game is to hodl, hold on for dear life and realize that the market is volatile and sometimes it may go down, but many times it'll go back up. And in fact, many of the people, what they do is whenever the price dips, just buy a little bit more. Want to buy another hundred bucks? Next dip, buy another hundred dollars. Great way to be able to own some Bitcoins and over time, who knows, you may have a really, really nice nest egg of the cryptocurrency buys you've made. Anyway, that's what I wanted to share with you. Um, 
The rain stopped. I actually have to go on to my next one, but I wanted to share this with you because my goal is to help empower you to be able to take the most advantage of the whole blockchain and cryptocurrency markets. And again, as I always say, we are changing the world one blockchain at a time. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you learned something in the process. I bring you brand new videos every single week, so make sure to subscribe to this channel. And if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. I would love to hear from you. Until next time, I'm George Levy. We're changing the world one blockchain at a time. See you next time.